solo crown and Forza are only available on new gen console. Is the PlayStation 4 ending? Definitely not, because 2023 has the most insane open world racing games for PlayStation 4. Starting with number 10, Underground Garage. This is a realistic car mechanic simulator game that gives players the opportunity to run their very own garage. Not only that, but the game gives you the ability to revive rusted cars and customize them. Then hit the roads in a small open world area and compete with other garage owners. Coming up next, number 2 is Recreation. It's a high speed racing game that combines driving, racing, stunts, and exploration in a vast open world sandbox. Players have the ability to customize their environment by creating their own obstacles such as jumps, loops, and ramps as well as building roads in various locations. Not only can players customize the environment, but they can also customize vehicles with different features and share their creations with other players. The game is coming later this year for PlayStation 4, 5 and Xboxes. Moving on to the next game, number 8 is 171. This is an open world game that takes place in the streets of South America and you can get straight into action and start earning money in a variety of ways from taking deliveries, taxi driving or even robberies and car chases and you can use vehicles like cars, trucks, and motorbikes with a vast open-world metropolis to explore. The game is currently in early access for PC, which means that it may have bugs or unfinished features. But it's a great opportunity for players to be part of the development process. And one of the most exciting things about 171 is that it is said to include storyline and missions, just like GTA games. The release window is rumored to be late 2023 to early 2024 for PlayStation and PC, so there is still some time to wait. That's why let's move on to the next game. Supercross 6, a motorcycle driving game that let players explore a massive free roaming environment and test their skills across five different main areas, the airport, the mine, the mountain, the stadium, and the park with every area connected by motorcycle tracks to the others and you can use them to practice, perform stunts, race or simply free roam in the world alone or with friends with different activities to complete. The game also lets you build your ideal track with the track editor and customize your rider and your bike with tons of customization and accessories. The game is so competitive and realistic and if this is what you are looking for, I want to let you know that this game is coming March 3rd, 2023 for PlayStation 4, PC and Xboxes. Moving on to game number 6. Saints Row, an action-adventure packed game that features open-world driving and racing elements. The game is not mainly a racing game, it's more like GTA where players have the freedom to explore a fictional city utilizing cars, motorbikes, boats and planes, and take on missions to progress in the overall story. Also, they can engage in a variety of side activities. The game provides a wide range of vehicles to suit your goal, whether you are looking for speed to race or something that can take a lot of damage to engage in battles. And you will find yourself doing a lot of driving from outrunning the cops to taking over other gangs or just cruising around the open world city, which is huge and features tons of landmarks and places like cities, mountains, countryside, and many more. The game is available for PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, and PC. Making its way to number 5, Police Simulator Patrol Officers In this game you take control of a police and you have to hit the streets and protect the city. You'll be driving a police car as you patrol the open world city, catching criminals and stopping illegal activities. You'll start off by citing violations and handling parking tickets, but soon you'll be facing more responsibilities and taking on bigger challenges such as car chases and stopping criminals. And you have to be alerted all the time because emergency situations may pop up at any moment. Explore three unique open districts, solo or with friends, and have fun playing as a police. The game features a dynamic traffic system, smart AI NPCs that have their own lives and activities, and a lot more features to make the experience fun and realistic. Police Simulator Patrol Officers was released end of 2022 for PlayStation 4, 5 and PC. Sitting at the fourth spot is WRC 23. This is a realistic open world rally racing simulation game. It features open areas that you can explore to get the full rallying sensation with the ability to explore multiple areas and environments from harsh mountain roads to city streets. The game also promises a more authentic and dynamic driving experience compared to previous WRC games. Along with these features, WRC 23 is said to let users design their own rally vehicles from scratch and alter a variety of visual elements and cosmetics to enhance their performance during races and also gain the edge in the competition. Even though these facts haven't been confirmed from developers, it is evident that WRC 2023 is going to be a groundbreaking and a solid addition to the WRC series. 
Moving on to the best open world racing games of 2023, sitting at the third spot is TT Isle of Man Ride on Edge 3. This is a realistic open world racing game that let players control one of many different motorcycles and race with other players in 32 different tracks, along with 200 kilometers of open roads to practice on and freely explore. The game offers players a variety of game modes. For those who want to compete with other players, the game offers a quick race mode where players can jump in and start racing with other players. For those who tend to favor a story and a narrative, the game features a career mod, which allows players to progress through the game and unlock new content. And for people who like to play with friends, the game includes online multiplayer mod, where players can team up and compete against others. The game is described as being simple to pick up, so anyone can jump in and start racing. And it will launch on the PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5 and PC in May of 2023. Next, in the second spot, we have Dakar Desert Rally. This game, in my humble opinion, is one of the best looking open world racing games ever. It was released late in 2022 and features some really good graphics and realistic physics. The game also features a wide range of licensed real life vehicles from motorcycles, cars, trucks, squads, and SSVs, offering unique challenges for players. And what makes it more interesting is that the tracks are also from real-life Dakar events that happen every year, which make the game authentic and realistic. Dakar Desert Rally features single-player and multiplayer mods, and also a free roaming space which includes deserts, snowy areas, normal roads, and more, with dynamic weather conditions and a day and night cycle. And now it's time for the most anticipated open-world racing game in 2023. At number 1 we have The Crew 3. This is one of the most anticipated racing games alongside Solo Crown and Forza and will be available in 2023 as Ubisoft launched a new game in The Crew series every 4 years. And with the last release being in 2018, which is The Crew 2, it's safe to assume that there will be a reveal trailer very soon. Overall, The Crew 3 will be an open world racing game with a Hawaii based setting and will have a persistent open world like the previous games, allowing players to explore the world and take control of a range of vehicles like cars, motorbikes, boats and airplanes. And now let me mention some bonus games that didn't make it to the top 10 yet still worth checking out. Ride 5, a new open world motorcycle game that is coming this year and features realistic graphics and physics and players can hop on powerful motorcycles and compete with other players. Car X Street, a free-to-play open-world racing game that is out for mobiles and soon for PC, and will be getting a console release late this year or probably next year in 2024. Madness of Road 4x4, an off-road open multiplayer simulator featuring a detailed map where players have to make deliveries of cargo. It also features a battle royale mode, which is kinda unexpected. MXGP 23 Every year we have a new MXGP game, and 2023 is no difference. The game is also a motorcycle game that features races between players, and also an open world area to free roam in and have fun. And finally, I wanna mention Sonic Frontier, which is not a racing game technically, but in this game you control Sonic, and you run everywhere racing enemies and running fast all over the place. That sounded like a racing game to me. Plus, it is set in an open world, so why not put it in the bonus section? And if you made it this far, tell me if you like these games for PlayStation 4. If not, you should definitely get a PlayStation 5. But before you do, check this video, it mentions the best PS5 games of this year. And as always, stay home, stay safe, play games and peace out.